Good people, once again it's Mshamba Marekali. And we're going to see it's the African Cultural Festival in St. Louis. So we're gonna go there. You can come come closer here. Oh, uh, we're gonna go there and talk to some people and see what's going on. So guys join me. All right, tell me about your products and where maybe if people wanna buy your products. I know they had this festival for like two or three days, so if people want to find you, where they can find you and maybe purchase some of your products? Where they can find us? Yes. We are up the, uh, the steps of the front of the African Arts Festival. We're in booth number five, so you can't miss us when you come up. So what about when the festival is over? Where can people find you and purchase your products? When the festival is over, yes. I, am I have a store. Yes. I have a store in the Grand Slam Flea Market that is on 367 in Chambers. I, um, the name of my store is Genuinely Me Shooty. All right, you guys, you had it. You can find her store and purchase her products. All right, thank you, ladies. Bye. We'll talk to this gentleman over here. How are you doing, sir? Hello, how are you? My name is Mshamba Marekani. I'm from Kenya. I'm talking to some of my African people over here. What's your name? George. Oh, you're from Kenya too? Uh, yeah. I'm How about it? Me and Mshamba Marekani. Oh, wow. All right, just tell me about your store, what you do, and where people can find you. You know, like this uh, store has, I mean, the festival is like four days, like, and it's going to be over. So uh, for those people who might not be able to uh, come over here and purchase something from you, because, you know, we have Kenyans from all over the states or other people, where they can find you and maybe purchase something from you. Yeah. Um I come from Minnesota. Um, I have a small in St. Paul, a small store in St. Paul. I, I do art and craft a lot, and I do mostly like um, African art and craft festivals. I do festival, um, and, um, festival of nations. So, so basically, I do art and craft shows, uh, especially in summer. I'm quite mobile in the U.S. Yeah. Yeah. So you, you normally go and do your setup in other states, it's not only over here? Yep, I do, um, I do many states, I do um, Minnesota, I do like um, Illinois, I do like um, even Arizona, I've been to Arizona, so I'm quite mobile, yep. And do you have an online, sto online store where people can find you or maybe on Facebook? Because you know nowadays most people are online, they would want to purchase something from you online. Do you have somewhere where they can find you, you can tell them? Yeah, I have a website, it's not really uh, very active. Um, I, I should have someone updating the, you know, the store. Yes. That's why I, I don't, I wouldn't really be very proud of that. I don't do that as good as I do in the festivals. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, and it's because our products go quick sometimes, um, I think it's a matter of time and having somebody work on, on that because I can't manage that by myself. All right. And um, where do you get most of your st uh, product? Is it just from back in Kenya or from different parts of Africa? Okay. Yeah, um, it's interesting because I began by making jewelry, me and my wife, and, um, and also we are selling products from Kenya, carvings, uh, jewelry, and also clothing. So it depends on the show we are doing. So if they say what we have done, I will bring my own jewelry that I make, 100%. If it's uh, an, an event like this uh, here, uh, we bring products that we think people will appreciate from Kenya and mostly sometimes some other parts of Africa. So that's what we do. It depends on what little people appreciate in any given event and, and the rules that they give us to follow. So, yeah. All right, thank you so much for the interview. You can find this whole interview on Shamba Marekani on YouTube. Thank you so much. Thank you guys for the surprise. I wasn't there. Say hi to, we have a lot, I have a lot of friends in Minnesota, St. Paul. Say hi to them. Tell them Shamba Marekani said hi. Thank you. Out here, some products from Africa. We can go this way. Yeah. Over here. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I should have talked to some of this. Hey, hey. 
crystal clear. Is it clear? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, that's your grandson? Oh, get down. <sighs> Keep recording. Good afternoon, Noah. So it's all kinds, a lot of people over here from different parts of Africa. Uh, we might find somebody maybe from, let's see if we're going to talk to some, we're going to talk to a gentleman over here. How are you doing, sir? My name is Shamba Marikani. What's your name? Nuka. Your name is Nyoka? Nuka. Nuka? I'm from Kenya. Where are you from? They call it Nigeria. You from Nigeria? Oh, so we got some Nigerian brother over here. Tell can find you online if they are unable to make it to the St. Louis Festival and maybe purchase your products. We are in St. Louis and the website is ishopnaturals.com. So ishopnaturals.com? All right. So tell me, tell the people around about your products and maybe, because you know this festival is a few days, if they are unable to come and make it to this uh, festival where they can find your products maybe online. So yeah, so I am a handmade soap maker and you can find my products online at Tondres and Sage, T-E-N-D-R-E-S-S-E -S -S -E and Sage. Um, dot com and so I have an online store where I have beautiful organic handmade soaps um, and personal care products okay thank you talking to a few people here and there uh, let's see Moshe <laughs> Tutashinda we got some African nice African t-shirts over here oh uh, how you doing my name is Shamba Marikani what's your name Kendra where are you from? I'm from St. Louis. I'm with the Organization for Black Struggle. What does uh, Pomoja to Tashinda mean? Together we can win. Uh, well, these are six dollars, and these are six dollars, two for ten. Uh, do you know what language is that? <laughs> <laughs> so do you guys only take cash, or you take debit too? Uh, we pay. You can go to our website. Yes. And pay online. Yes. Uh -huh. yeah, so do you have like, uh, what's, your, what's your website? Do you have a business card? We have a leaflet over here. Our website is obs-stl.org. Okay, can you give me the leaflet maybe? Yeah. And uh, can you tell me a little bit about your products and what you do? So we're a grassroots organizing nonprofit. So we focus on voter engagement and voter empowerment in order to hold elected officials accountable and build power in our community, especially with the black working class. Yep, and these books, um, Ferguson is America, are $15 each on sale for 15 and the proceeds go to our youth department. Okay, so but you can find all your products online. You can pay for them online. You okay. can find them online. Oh, okay. Yeah. So let me let me ask you about uh if somebody wants to learn Swahili, or you, where can maybe an African American or an American they want to learn some Swahili, where do you think or where can they find the information to do that? Well, we teach um, key Swahili like greeting terms and other general terms, so we do that. I don't know out, outside of uh, our organization, off the top of my head, who else does that? <laughs> yeah. So, what is a goat in Swahili? <laughs> One more time. A goat in yes. Swahili? Yes. Or, or a ship? Or a ship. Well, well, I do know how to say is Habarigani. <laughs> a goat in Swahili is Kondoshe. Kondoshe. Okay. Asante for teaching me that. Can you say Kondoshe? Kondoshe. <laughs> no, actually, a goat in Swahili is Mbuzi. <laughs> <laughs> no, all right. Thank you so much for the interview. All right. Karibu. Walk around here. We got some brothers over here. How you guys doing? My name is Mshamba Marikani. I'm from Kenya. Uh, what's your name? I'm John. John, where are you from? Uh, what's your name? Ellie. Ellie? Yeah. You're from Ghana too? Can you guys tell uh, uh, my viewers about your products and uh, if they are unable to find, uh, to make it to the festival, where they can find your products and buy them online? All right, so everything out here is from Ghana. Um, it's original cotton. Uh, these are polished cotton. These are batiks. And we're on elibacollections.com. Eliba Collection? Eliba Collections. E-L-I-B-A collections.com. 
you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, uh, Etsy. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much, guys. That's, uh, so we, that's uh, some of the products straight from Ghana, as you guys can see. And uh, as he told you guys, uh, I leave uh, collections online. You can find them and purchase something from them. All right. So we'll keep walking and see. Turn the AV. Oh, it's getting really hot over here. Ah, it's too many people over here. We we'll talk to one of our brothers over here. Uh, how you doing? My name is Mishamba Marekani. What's your name? Sorry. Sorry, where are you from? From uh, Chicago. You're from Chicago? Yes. Uh, can you tell me something about Africa? Well, where I'm from, West Africa, originally from Mali. Uh -huh. So it's a desert area. Yes. And it's, uh, most of the time it's a hot climate. Yes. Uh, winter time is only about a month or a month and a half at the most. Oh, okay. so you guys have winter in, uh, does it snow in Mali? No, no snow. <laughs> Oh, just rain. Um, how do you say hi in? Uh, you guys speak French, isn't it? Yeah, French. Okay. Fulani, Bambara. Okay. W what's the main language apart from French? Bambara. Oh, Bambara. Yeah. Okay. Uh, tell my viewers about your shop and what you do and where they can find you, purchase your product. Well, from here we are based in Chicago. Our store is uh, on West 95th Street. And the name of the store is Jenny Collection, uh, is in the west side of the city. It's 1759 West 95th Street, Chicago, Illinois. Okay, do you have a, a business card. Uh -huh. This is our business card. Oh, okay. And this is our website. Okay. So uh, basically, the website is www.jennycollection.com. And uh, from here, we got uh, the phone numbers and the address, which is uh, 1759 West 95th Street. Our store hours every day from 10 to 8. So we got uh, African clothing, as you can see. Yes. Closing, this and this is the same connected, it's connected to the same store. So fabric, uh, jewelry, shea butter, body oils, and much more to offer. Okay. We also do custom-made clothing as well mm -hmm. and alterations. Oh, okay. Yeah. So what what are the price ranges for the those price people? Price ranges are from fifteen to hundred and fifty. Okay. Yep, that's for our closing fifteen dollars to hundred fifty dollars. We also sell the fabric is five dollars a yard to seven dollars. The mud club is thirty five dollars a piece. Uh -huh. All right, thank you so much. Is it our uh, Maxi Boku? <laughs> All right, take care, brother. Yeah, we should go. Can I get in there too right now? Yes. You want to talk? How, what's your name? My name is Mishamba Maragami. What's your name? Mishamba Maragami. I'm Raheem Mishamba Maragami. Where are you from, Raheem? I'm from L.A. You're from where? Tell me. Lower Alabama. <laughs> <laughs> I came to uh, St. Louis from Chicago, Illinois. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're here doing this, doing this show. Uh, the show has been magnificent so far. Yeah. But uh, it's going to get, it's going to even, it's even better. You know what I'm saying? Because it gets, you know. Better with time, no, no question. No, the best is yet to come. So are you selling some products over here? Yes, sir. Yeah, we. The, the company is named Sakina. Here's the card here. Uh, we are here. We're based in Houston, Texas. Uh, I'm an art dealer from Chicago. Uh, I'm, I'm enjoying. I'm enjoying this St. Louis trip. Uh, I, I'll be back ASAP because we're gonna continue to do. We do nationwide too, as a matter of fact. We do shea butter, black soap, skirts, dashiki, the things of that sort. Oh, excuse me. So where is your shop? Can you take us to your shop? Uh, right now we don't have a shop. We're giving open open up a shop in Houston, Texas, uh, and hopefully we'll be opening within the next year or so. So just uh, stay tuned. Can you tell people about your products and uh, uh, the price ranges or where they can find you? Uh, are you do you have any locations in the other cities or is it just Houston? Yeah, we do we do nationwide tours. Like, like I said, we we all over. Uh, we are all, all all over the country. We give it, we give it to go abroad. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we 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 just constantly move, constantly moving, constantly moving. We making different connections all across the country, and uh, we we'll hopefully make, make connections all across the world. So much. 
have a nice trip. Uh, yes, sir. Appreciate you you appreciate say you're going back to. Uh, I, I don't know what's what's without without I don't know what's on the agenda for us next, but uh, we'll be we will be moving around all summer long through all through through the whole country, and uh, I don't know when we'll be back in St. Louis. Hopefully, we we'll be back in Houston soon. I'll be back in Chicago see my grandbabies. Hey y'all, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, everybody, y'all have a good one. Peace and love. All right, thank it. you. Let me get your business card. Yeah, absolutely, yes sir, yes sir. Yeah, All right, take care, sir. My brother, appreciate it. Yes, you. <laughs> Another car. Let's go this way. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, talk to this guy. You camera shy. What's in it? Okay, you. This is your shop. All right. Tell tell people about your shop where they can. You know. <laughs> okay, he doesn't want to tell people about his shop, so we'll go to somebody else and uh, see what we can get. That's a customer base. Okay. Okay, let's let's keep moving. <laughs> Cause we can't record everything, but let's see. Let's see. If we're gonna talk to somebody here before he gets some customers. How you doing, sir? My name is Mishamba Marekani. What's your name, sir? What's your name? My name is Mishamba Marekani. My name is Sambaka. Sambaka? Yeah. Where's that name from? That's a strong name. I'm from Kenya. Can you tell me what is this? Say butter. Say butter? Uh -huh. So can you tell the viewers about what it is and uh, just a little bit about your products and when maybe they... It's a uh, skin moisturizer. It's uh, come yellow and white. The yellow one is uh, more moisturizer. It's like uh, for more dry, dry skin. The white one is a straight say butter. It's like for less dry skin. So what are the benefits of using it? The benefits is using it, say what, it's for health, for skin, all over from head to toe. So does it help? Not, not enough to say it. it's just health. So does it help uh, lighten up the skin? Maybe I'm a dark skin guy, I want to be a little bit lighter. It's, it's not lighten up the skin, no. It's to give your skin healthy. Oh, okay. So it doesn't just make the skin glow? Uh, uh, it doesn't make the skin glow? Uh, no, it's for like an uh, authorizer. Stuff like that. Oh, okay. So where can people find your products online? Do you have a shop online? or? Uh, I close my shop in online. But you still can find somebody in line who, who do shave butter. A lot. All right. Thank you, sir. How do you say... How to say what? How do you say goodbye in your language? Uh, Yaram. Yaraba? Yaram, yeah. What language is that? Fulani. Fulani? Yaraba. Yaram. All right. Thank you, sir. Take care. Oh, my God. Excuse me. So let's see. Let's see if we can talk to some more people here. Or talk to. A, oh, hold on. I think he's he's got some customers. <sighs> okay, we can talk to him. Uh, I don't think he's in the middle of the transaction with some customer. How are you doing, Sam? My name is Mshamba Marikani. Is this your shop? Yes, it is. How are you? I'm doing fine. What's your name, sir? Perry Brooks. Can you tell me about your products? Can you tell the uh, the viewers about your products? And uh, so we have a uh, incense oils, black soap, handmade jewelry, imported goods. These are scarves from Ethiopia and hats. We got the frankincense and myrrh from Ethiopia. We also have shea butter, black soap, um, handmade earrings, and clothing as well. So all these they're handmade from Ethiopia. Yeah, all these are handmade, real cotton. So if somebody wanted to find you, like, because if somebody wanted to find you online, do you have a shop or something like that? Our shop is in Louisiana, but we ship wherever, mm -hmm. you know, and we are called We Three Kings, okay. and we're from Scotlandville, Louisiana, right outside of Baton Rouge. Okay. Yes. So let me get one of these. So uh, I'm going to ask you something. Uh, tell me something about Africa. You know, you're selling African products. I want to know if you know something about Africa. Do I know something about it? Yes. It's a continent. Uh, who's Nelson Mandela? I'm not a fan of Nelson Mandela. But I who? Like the real Mandela, Winnie Mandela. May she rest in peace. But no, uh, we just came back from Ethiopia two weeks ago. Yes. So we were able to do some good uh, trading as well as exploring. So who is the, there's an icon from Ethiopia. What's his name? Um, Teddy Afro. An icon. He already died. 
<laughs> no, you mean uh, Haile Selassie. Yes. Some say he never died because they never found a body. Okay. Yes, yes. So, so we have a Haile Selassie's picture here as well. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's really nice. All right, thank you so much. Thank you. What country are you from? I'm from Kenya. Kenya? Oh, yes. I love Kenya. We like uh, Mombasa. You've been to Mombasa? Yes, the big city. Did you have fun? I loved it. I loved it. Yes. <laughs> so, uh, we do, what, what are those products, the yellow ones? So that's the shea butter over here, and we have excellent prices, 5 and $10, and then also the raw black soap. So what can you recommend? You know, most ladies nowadays, they want to like glowing skin, lighten up their skin a little bit. What can you recommend that? I recommend you leave your skin chocolate and dark and melanated like it is, but to smooth out your skin and smooth out your complexion, the shea butter, olive oil, and coconut oil was the best things you can use. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. Yeah. So we can go over here, this side. So there you go, ladies. You don't have any. You don't have to buy anything to lighten up your skin. So just leave your skin the way it is. So uh, we're just gonna go around and show the products. So African products over here. So and I'll leave. I'll leave a link in the description where you guys can can buy some nice African clothing over there. And. We have some she batter over here, over here. Uh, we'll keep going and talking to some more people and see what they're going on. Right? How you doing, ma'am? How you doing, ma'am? <laughs> How you doing? Let me ask you a question, ma'am. <laughs> I know, just one question. <laughs> how y'all doing? doing? Fine, how, how you doing, sir? Hey, how you doing, sir? Can I talk to you for a second? Uh, do you have a shop? Do you have a shop over here? You know what? Uh, do you want to talk to the brother Dwayne? This is his shop. Uh -huh. I think he's... Uh, and uh, he's got some very beautiful things. Let me, let me show you a couple of things. Yes, got. just show me. Show me. This is the one, the one of the things that we're getting here right here. Mm -hmm. Is it hot? It's really That's hot. hot. That's hot. You know, I'll eat things real nice and cool. Yes. And they got a bunch of other stuff. Let me show you some other stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got that media thing. You know, I, you know, I just met the brother, and he's a beautiful man, and this kind of stuff he got. Now, my daughter got this one. Yes. But I was tripping off. They had one. They had uh, one. Number one is going to really turn you on. Uh, where is that one y'all with the, with the, with the, uh... So what do you call this animal? Is this a lion? Oh, you know what, I think it's like a leopard or something. This a lion? Is it? Or yeah, is it, yeah, is I think it's a, uh, it could be like a, a I thought it was a tiger at first, but I think it's a leopard, like a white leopard. I'll let my viewers decide. You know? Right. I think this is a cat. Right, right, right. Okay. Look, look, look how you like this one. That's really cool. That's cool, ain't it? So tell me, tell me about uh -huh. your products. Like, if people want to find your products, where they can. Right, right here, this brother right here gonna tell you. I'm just a customer. I'm right. just a happy customer. Yes. You know tell me saying? about. Hey. All right. I'm How you doing, sir? He, he, he can tell you better. Right right uh, okay. uh, go ahead. Tell him where to find it. Where people can find your products uh, online if you're not here. I do not have an online. I do not have an online store right now. But you can find me in Chicago at the Swaparama, 100, on 127th Street. Cicero. All right. And uh, what are the price ranges like for the customers? From 15 to 25 dollars. Okay. All right. Thank you so much, sir. Okay. Thank you. Take care. Y'all like your people. So huh? we'll keep. Oh yeah. Well, hang in there, man. Y'all getting it. Y'all getting it. Y'all getting, getting it done right, man. Okay. Let me ask you for one question uh, okay. about Africa. Okay. What up? Uh, this is a question I've been asking people. What part of uh, Africa is South Africa? The south, southern part. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> <laughs> That's what, one of the only guys. Most people have been getting that question wrong, but we got a smart brother over there. <laughs> Let's see if we're gonna talk to some old people over here. <laughs> Let me see. Let me see. I don't know. I don't even know who's the owner of the shop over here. Uh, excuse me, do you know who is the owner of this shop? Is that you? What? Are you the owner? Oh, him? Oh, okay, he's busy. I wanted to talk to somebody a little bit, but he's actually a little bit busy. Yes. I think he's a little bit busy. Uh, how you doing, sir? My name is Mushamba Marikani. Mr. Mushamba Marikani, I'm from Kenya. From Mushamba Marikani, from Kenya? Yes. What's your name? 
Mr. Yabuana do Nassinha. Uh, you don't speak English? I'll try. A little bit? A little bit, yes. So tell, I just saw, tell people about your products and where they can find your products. I know you're about to close for the day, so just a tell the viewers a little bit about your products. You can speak in French if you want to, it doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, bonjour à tout le monde. Je viens de l'Afrique centrale. Proprement Congo, Kinshasa. Yeah. So, do you speak Swahili? Oh, na sukumu da Swahili kambi sakabi sa vizuri sana. Na sinda da mi nanga Swahili. Ambi o atu pale na o ambi ni tawa translate yana kizungu about your products. Kama wana isasi pata online. Ndi o products zangu zina kujia Afrika. Products zangu zote zime fanyo kama mikono. Hakuna kitu moja kina kujia China. Ni o kitu ko proper kambi sa kaucha Afrika kaucha. So he say the, the products, they're handmade from Africa. It's everything that you can see over there. And we're going to show you guys is everything is handmade from Africa. So, and uh, let's see one of this one. You can see like this. This uh giraffe -huh. came to Zimbabwe. Okay. This is Zimbabwe. 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 This is Kenya. This is Zimbabwe. This is Uganda. This is Zimbabwe. 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 So, so, uh, if they want to find you, he say, oh, the, 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 this, uh, like this giraffe is from uh, Kenya. Yeah, from Zimbabwe. This is from Zimbabwe, and uh, we'll show you some, some of the stuff from uh, like uh, Kenya and all that. So, let me, what you cool is there? I'm going to ask him where you can find him online. So, you can find him online. So, you can find him online. So, you can online. So, you can website. But, I'm going to email address. Tukipatana na mutu, akiona wikiwitu yaki wikimufraisha. Na mpatia hidi emilo adresi yangu, tunapatia na randevu, o nini, appointment fasi moja, tunafanya vyashara fasi kwa sababu. Oh, he says for right now he doesn't have an address, but I'm asking him like the building location or the state where they can find you. So unapatika na state gani mali kwa duka umeka vitu zako? Niko hapa St. Louis, hiyo njo mju wangu, nitoka Afrika, tangu 2004 niko hapa. Njoo fasi yangu mimi. Muto so kata. duka yako iko wapi? Sina duka lakini natembea kwenye free market na free market paka hivi. Okay, so if you guys, he's from Africa, he doesn't have like a physical location. But you guys, if you go to the, the free markets around St. Louis, you'll be able to find him over here. So thank you so much, sir. We're going to show people some of your products so they can see. And whoever is interested, they might contact me and I might tell them to find you in the flea market or whenever there's a... Uh, like an African festival over there. So do you have any any other thing? Kuna kitu ingine unataka kuambia watu kuhusu product zako ama kumalizia tu? Na shukuru sana, lakini shukuru sana kama watu wanapenda vitu kutoka Afrika hitu hiko riu, hiu kweli, hiu anaita kama African culture. Wakuje kwetu wataviona, tunapote explanation, hii kitu kinamana gani, kinafanya kazi gani, tunafanya kila kitu tunawazitu. Kwa wale kama wale wa ndugu zetu walitoka kwa zamani huko hapa African American tu wana na kuexplain wasikie kwa hiyo culture yetu kwa namna gani na wasikie kweli walitoka fasi walitoka tunaishi namna gani na tunakula namna gani Oh uh, what he said is his products they are real genuinely from Africa and he's he's just not only selling you the product he's telling you about the history behind the culture so for most of uh, like uh, my African American brothers or the Americans who want to find out about the product they are buying and the history behind the product he will be able to tell you so thank you so much thanks very much kwa jina langu naitiwa kwa Mr. Yabwana Yadona eh company yangu ni Roots of Africa his name is Yabwana Yadona. His company is Roots of Africa. All right, thank you so much. Nashukuru sana, Bwana. Asante sana. Uh, there's another guy who wants to speak. Unaweza ongea kizungu? Apama. Unaongea tu Kiswahili? Naongea Kiswahili. Oh, he can He can only speak Swahili and French, so I'm going to try and play the translator too. So, uh, jina yako ni nani? Jina yangu ni Israel Bonane. Uh, his name is Israel Bonane. So, ume, ume toka wapi? Ume toka wapi Africa? Mimi natoka Africa, Congo. DRC, Congo. So, you're from the DRC, Congo. Not the other one, Congo Zaire. He's Congo from... Zaire, yes. Ni Congo Zaire? Ndiyo. Ni, ni kitu moja? Ndiyo, ni kitu moja. Ex Zaire. Oh, okay. So, wambia watu kusu product zako. Uh, munafanya kazi na ye yeah, ye yeah, pamoja, sinda? Ndiyo. Okay. Nwambie tu kuhusu product zako, kitu kitu kidogo tu. Product zangu, mimi ni artist, na chonga mti, na chonga jue, uh, niko Amerika miaka mitatu, 
na kwa hiyo miaka mitatu nimeingia ku festival okay. so mtu akataka kuchongewa kitu akwambie hii ni simba mi nataka unichongee simba ina kwa muti ndachonga okay so he say he's a he's a carving like you know carving us artist like you can how you can carve this one and he can make it if for you guys maybe you want a for him to carve a coyote for the american guys or a raccoon he can actually carve it for you and uh he's been doing this for a long time so he'll be able to give you a good product uh nina nina experience ya miaka zaidi miaka 10 na 5 ya experience nimechonga congo na chonga rwanda na chonga nilichonga uganda nilichonga kenya na hizo manafasi zote nilichonga Rwanda ku watu wakaplakiwa wananijua nilichonga Uganda batu ya Gaba Road wananijua nilichonga nilitumika Kenya watu wa Kikomba wananijua Sawa so, asante sana asante sana asante kwa heri so he said he's, he has a lot of ex experience he has uh, do carvings in Africa all over African countries and uh, he has a lot of experience so if you guys you can find him in the flea markets in St. Louis and maybe if you want something carved for you you can talk to him all right